Welcome to Firewise in the Classroom, an interactive curriculum for students grades 6 through 12. Firewise in the Classroom dives into geography, science, and social sciences of wildland fire. The curriculum was developed by Minnesota Department of Natural Resources as part of the National Firewise USA program. Though the content was first introduced to students in 2001, it has been modernized several times over the years. Typically, it's served through a physical classroom. However, we've made the learning available online, realizing that both teachers, students are at home these days and unable to access it otherwise. The curriculum was developed by the Department of Natural Resources in 2001 as part of the National FireWise USA program to reduce wildfire risks in communities. Content was developed by Department of Natural Resources professionals, as well as teachers from the Minnesota Alliance for Geographic Education and other specialties. There are several student learning goals for the curriculum. Understand what wildland fire is, understand the causes and the effects of wildland fire, understand the risks of wildland fire to communities, understand how FireWise can help communities reduce this risk, use GIS to assess community risk, and communicate why FireWise information learned to the community. There are nine chapters in the FireWise in the classroom curriculum. Chapters one through eight each take about 20 minutes. Students will be following along in their user guide, interactively answering questions. There will also be several exercises throughout the chapters. Chapter nine is typically a group lesson where students are creating a community report about the GIS data that they have developed. This report may be shared with local fire departments, community leaders, or other groups that wish to mitigate wildland fire in the community. A FireWise specialist can be available to help with this particular chapter. This is the first time that we've offered the FireWise in the Classroom content online in order to best serve our teachers and students. We consider it a work in progress and we invite your inquiries as well as your suggestions and comments. Either visit our website or send us an email. We appreciate your interest and hope you find this content valuable.